Okay, we're in Delta, uh, Utah. This is the first horse we're going to do. Four-year-old. Uh, call this horse Machine. I just want to walk around and talk a little bit about him. This horse has a great confirmation. I love his size. To me, this is a great size horse. You can head and, head and or peel on that. This is the first time I've ever seen this horse or been around him, and what a great nature, you know. This horse just seems super gentle, super easy to be around. We picked his feet up, walked around him, extremely gentle, expect great things out of him. box and the steers jump around and rattle the chute and rattle the gates when the horse still stays really relaxed like that steer they said they just got him and never roped him but steer kind of jumped around in the chute and rattled around this horse never never moved he didn't jump jump forward like a lot of horses do sometimes when the steers jump around the chute stayed really calm and they said that steer might run so I kind of got out on him too soon but other than that So we had roped three or four kind of older, slower steers. And kind of, he just broke that one in yesterday, so I wanted to run him. Man, this horse was so easy when I roped. Just to never try to get strong, never try to step out. Man, he let me just rope, get it tight to the horn, keep that steer moving, keep it tight. Had a great angle coming back up the arena just a little bit and keep that steer on the end of the rope. Of course, felt outstanding on fresh steer right there. five or six steers heading on him right there I really like I scored the steer before that he kind of wanted to pull on me a little bit scoring but he stayed and then whenever I went to leave the box he just put his head down and, and walked out you know he didn't 
didn't try to lunge out or prance out or jump out of the box at all. I like walking a horse out of the box. It gives you an idea of like, you know, how calm and relaxed they are. If they just walk out like that, they're so calm and relaxed. I mean, I have horses and I've been on horses that you let them go and they, they want to lunge out of the box. They want to, they're used to running. And so I thought this horse did outstanding in every, every regard. He kind of has a little tiny bit of what I think is like a horse show face. He don't want to get slide onto his butt, uh, but still faces, you know, still faces plenty fast enough and faces good. He pulls strong. He has a great angle. Easy to rope the horns on, you know. He never tried to get quick and never wanted to run by the steer. He got to a spot and let me rope the horns really easy. I thought he did so good. So we've healed two so far. We'll heal one more. This horse is definitely way further along as a head horse. A finished head horse just needs season and really green to heal on, but really willing to let you put him where you want. Reads your throw good and wants to stop off your throw, has a really good smooth stop. Just a little bit green and you kind of have to help him, help him get where you want him and kind of place him where you want him. But still great in the box, gentle, easy to get where you want to be down the arena, pretty easy to ride, you just got to kind of help you get where you want. We've kind of talked about everything already, like I said, this horse still feels green to heal on, but it's nice about having one that's really broke, it's just so easy to put right there. And he has such a nice stop that he feels you sit down and if he wants to stop. So it wouldn't take any time at all. And you'd be hauling this horse with the heel horse. So I've liked everything I've seen about this horse. Heading, healing, just being around him, gentle to be around. Just a really nice horse.